All right, so here we are on the floor in the middle of the maintenance turnaround. I just want to kind of cover what's going on. The engineer is taking the bottom of the combustor part. I showed that in a video. Cleaning the coral out. Checking the burner. Going upstairs. Blowing down through the heat exchanger and then cleaning out the anhydrous injection port. You can see the material that comes down on the floor here, all the ash and stuff. You can't have that in the burner. That would cause a lot of problems. So we pull the burner out, we can do that and put the burner back in. So when you're up there, you're going to clean out the sample port. You're going to clean out the sample filter. Take the umbilical apart. Uh, two operators that are going to be working on the wet scrubber okay and their job is to dump the solution that's in it dump the water and slurry that's in it put some fresh water in it flush it for a little while they'll circulate some water in it and they're gonna drain it out they're gonna take the top apart they're gonna pull all the packing out of it they're gonna clean the demister they're gonna replace the packing they're gonna put it back together and they're going to probably put a solution in, water with a little red lime, and circulate it uh, just to clean it out. Uh, and then they'll drain that out, put water, and get ready to run. But that's there's a couple of guys that are going to be focused on that. The other operator works on the ESP. He washes the ESP down, he washes the inlet pipe all the way across the back side of the control panel there. Uh, so when we shut down, the SOP is to turn off the Watlows, unplug the power supply. So the power supply is, is off, the Watlows are off. So those are plugs in the back. So we're going to unplug those, you're going to tag the outlet, okay? Uh, and then I always make sure I tell the operator, you do not touch that ESP until that is, is de-energized and tagged. So that's how we do that. So he's washing down the ESP back there. Uh, he'll have drained it, wrapped it, and drained it, gotten the ash out, gotten the way back on that, and then they wash that. And uh, they wash the inlet pipe. They get quite a bit of material out of there. That's really all we can do on the turnaround. Um, the bulk of the work is, is on the wet scrubber. So. The next step is going to be to put the furnace back together. Once the top is is cleaned out, um, you want to be pretty quick about it. Get this burner back in there and stop that convective heat loss. Um, you know, with that open port in the bottom of the furnace, uh, we have been off offline for about an hour and a half to two hours, typically while we're doing the maintenance. About two in the morning, we go on gas. And then about three in the morning, we go on coal. At about four o'clock, we're all lined out, everything's ready to go, and we, we bring the carbon capture kit back online. So that's an idea of the timeline of all of this and, and what's going on. So, uh, you know, have a, have, a, have a chat with the operations staff. Okay, who's working on the wet scrubber? Who's doing the ESP? Have they done the wet scrubber? Do they know what they need to do? Is everybody clear on that? Is everybody clear on that? And, you know, make sure you, you're familiar with this. Everybody's going to have a first time doing it, but you know, get the cart, get the tools. Remember, drop the burner, clean the top, put the top back together, put the burner back in. Uh, that's that's in a nutshell what the what the what the maintenance list is going to have you do. The other thing the engineer is going to do is double check all the samples are there. Put up new log sheets for the next run. Stop data logging change the file name, start data logging, copy the data using that USB drive. So in the morning, all the weights have been recorded, all the log sheets are in the folder. We're logging on the correct data file for the next day, and the, the old data file is on that thumb drive in the morning. Mr. Musich will come and get it. So uh, in a nutshell, that, that's what you're going to do. Again, follow the maintenance list. Um, take that maintenance list. Take this around, this main take this list around to everybody working. You know, the white guys on the wet scrubber. Okay, is this all done? Were there any issues or anything we need to add to this list? Anything we should should be doing differently? It's all good. Have them initial it. Go to the next section in the list. ESP, is that clean? 
any issues there anything we need to change okay so that's just how it rolls go through each section of that list get everybody to sign off on it uh, and maintenance is uh, it's not a big deal you just got to keep everybody moving get through it in a short period of time just make sure people are doing it safely and uh, and we won't have a problem <laughs>